Good morning, good morning, and I am back at the theater. There is all this stuff behind me that is still in need of painting, which is why I'm here today. It is Monday. I didn't vlog yesterday because I just didn't feel like it. And the extent of my productivity, oh, I did my laundry, and I made my mom another mask. At work, she has the nickname Honey Badger for some reason. Um, one of the young kids <laughs> gave it to her, I guess. And so I made her a mask with a honey badger on it. The important things I've been doing with my life. <laughs> yeah, I listened to a lot of Harry Potter. That's pretty much the extent of it, but that's fine. I think I cleaned, I fed myself, I don't know. Anyways, it wasn't worth, <laughs> it wasn't worth documenting. I am here, obviously, and I only came specifically to paint furniture today. Uh, I have, as I mentioned last time, those three benches plus this one and then these two tables to finish. I finished the second coat on these guys just before I left. They're looking pretty good. Nice. And then these guys are done. These two just weren't dry when I left the other day, so yay. I'm hoping, I'm gonna double check these guys, but I'm hoping that two coats is good for them. I think it should be. And I'm hoping that I can get all this done in about four hours. I painted these two, the second coat, in an hour combined on my last shift. So I think that with six pieces, four hours should be good enough, but we will find out. Ah, that red painting. Uh, so that's where we're at. I think I definitely need to shower today because my hair is disgusting and I don't remember when I last showered. It's fine. This is, this is nothing new. <laughs> I'm just bad at remembering to shower. Anyways, I set up my agenda yesterday, so I have a pretty big list. I think my goal for this week needs to be to do more writing, writing. So I think I'm gonna put like a pause on making masks because like I really enjoy doing that, but I actually put my sewing machine away. I have an old toy box that I've had for ages and it perfectly fits the sewing machine. So I put it away yesterday in an effort to keep myself on track and get some writing done. So that is the plan for today. I don't know what I'm gonna work on when I set up my agenda. I just wrote K1 and two and figure it out later, but. We'll see. Anyways, I'm gonna have my breakfast drink and I'm going to get to work. And then, yeah, <laughs> that's it. Well, hello, I am home and this is a new angle. I used to vlog on top of this thing all the time and I just haven't forever, but I don't know if you can hear it. There's construction like right at the end of the driveway. There's construction everywhere. It's just everywhere. So I worked and I got paint all over me. It's uh, much worse than it was the other day. I'm pretty sure there's paint in my hair again. It's fine, I'll shower today. And it was pretty good, it was pretty chill. It took me four hours, but it was like a lazy four hours. But because of the hours I had, I have left, I know I couldn't work more than four hours. So it's fine, I just painted the rest of the furniture, took off all the paint, put things back that I could, and then everything else is just chilling to dry. Tomorrow I'm gonna go in and put it back where it belongs, cause it'll all be dry then and I'm gonna paint some doors, but my battery's gonna die, so I'm gonna go make lunch now and then try to be productive today, but I'm near the end of my Harry Potter series and so I might just listen to the rest of the book and there's like four hours left in it. It's fine. time entirely <laughs> it is 20 after 6 now I just really wanted to listen to the rest of Harry Potter is basically what it was so I had 
lunch while listening to Harry Potter. I cleaned up and tidied and organized while listening to Harry Potter. I cut a bunch of the fronts of masks while listening to Harry Potter. And then I really ran out of things I could do while listening to Harry Potter. I could have cut more masks, but, you know, sitting here cutting masks for like a couple hours, it's kind of like tiring <laughs> which you wouldn't think so but just like sitting here like same thing same thing same thing anyways I think I have like 19 fronts of masks now which is a lot I don't have enough ribbon or anything at this point but I do have ribbon on the way which is supposed to be here in like a month because it's a non-essential thing from Amazon and I think on Thursday what's today Monday. Today is Monday. So I think on Thursday when my mom and I go do our grocery shop and get my grandma groceries, we're going to go to the dollar store because my cousin's girlfriend told me that they have like some elastic thread that she's been using for masks and it works really well. So hopefully I can get some of that because I think it would be nice too to have some that you don't have to tie. Like have a nice mix. But that's pretty much all I got up to. I don't know. I'm kind of hungry now. It was like I said 6.20. My mom is off at 7.30 I think so waiting for her for dinner but that's fine and I've slowly been plucking away on my list I just got out of the shower obviously and I think I got all the paint yeah all the paint is gone which is nice so things I have to do type up some of my character sheets <laughs> maybe exercise <laughs> um, email our social media girl at work because she's putting together like um, a staff favorites albums like quarantine albums so email her that potentially email my grandma and check in on her but I'm gonna be emailing her tomorrow anyways or the next day just to double check their grocery list and then it is Strudel's mom's birthday soon and I bought this card ages ago like February ages ago. It's not a birthday card, but I was like, I'm getting to send it to his birthday card. So it says, pet all the dogs. <laughs> and then on the inside it says, in the end, nobody ever says they wish they hadn't pet so many dogs, which is like our friendship. <laughs> just pet all the dogs. Although I'm just realizing that the inside here is very cute and velvety, but I cannot write on that. So anyways, it's her birthday on the 29th according to my sources so I need to get that sent because it'll take probably about a week to get to blind channel just because like it leaves here and then it goes and gets sorted and then it comes back here I think and then it gets on a float plane <laughs> takes a little while so that's on my list of something to do today because I just pop in the mailbox tomorrow but yeah we're doing pretty good my list is going pretty well I feel like I should sit down now and work on my character sheets, but also I kind of want to braid my hair and I kind of just want to take a break for a minute because like my brain is like, Phew. I was listening to the end of Harry Potter and I was like, oh wow, this is such a great way to end a good series. And then it went epilogue 19 years later. I was like, no, still mad about it. Anyways, I'm going to go now and I'll hopefully check back in in a little bit. And not so long from now. So being the uh, non-productive person that I am, well, well, I mean, I guess I was kind of productive while I was cooking dinner. I decided to start watching Harry Potter because obviously I just finished reading it. So let's waste many more hours watching the movies. But Netflix only has five, six, and the two parts of seven. So I was like, oh, I guess I'll start on five. I'm sure I mentioned it, but like five is my favorite book. And the movie just doesn't do it justice at all. It's just, ah. Uh, just ah, uh, just ah, uh, but I'm almost done though. I think I'm gonna finish watching that now. Dinner is done with, we're all good. I was helping my mom make a list for tomorrow because she has to go talk about shopping, so she's gonna pick some stuff up while she's at the store. And we're gonna have nachos on Wednesday. And so I was like, oh, the El Restaurante chips are like the best for that because they're so salty, it's so good. <laughs> and so I like walk over to help her with the list and she has spelled tortilla torrelia and I was like I don't even know how to fix that it's so bad she's like I know and then I was like barring that though Tostitos are pretty good as well they're just not as salty and she's like writes it down she's like well I almost got that right and she spelt it oh, what was it it was to tosistos and um so we laughed about that and then she's like oh or like the President's Choice triangle ones and so she wrote PC 
T-R-I-S. And I was like, what is that? She's like, tries. I'm like, doesn't tries like have different letters in it? And she's like, I was going to write triangle, but I already screwed up those ones and I didn't want to spell them wrong. <laughs> so we just laughed. She's like, I've been working too hard, <laughs> which to give her the benefit of the trout. <laughs> we'll get to that in a second. Um, she has been working a lot. <laughs> But yeah, no, earlier today I was like, I don't know where it came from, but I was like, benefit of the trout instead of benefit of the doubt, and I just giggled like crazy about it. By myself, of course. And then I was like, I gotta do something with this, so I saved it into my notes, and then I opened up my notes, and it just said benefit of the trout, and I had forgot about it at that point, so I thought it was hilarious. So benefit of the trout, so funny. Anyways, <laughs> it is... 8.30 now. That's one thing that sucks with my mom working so much is like we're eating dinner so late and plus being so sedentary right now it's not for the best but it is fine. I'm going to finish watching Order of the Phoenix because I think I only have like 45 minutes left and then assuming I stick to my plan <laughs> I think I'm gonna do the card and then do the typey type. Typey type. Card typey type. Card I would say in a shocking turn of events, but honestly, it's not shocking, nor is it a turn of events. Um, I didn't do any of my writing stuff. <laughs> Are we surprised? We shouldn't be. <laughs> I did do every, almost everything else on my list, though. I checked in on my grandma while I sent her a very lengthy email, keeping her up to date on what we're doing as well. I gotta sneeze. I gotta sneeze. All right, we're good. Um, I also sent the card to Strudel's mom, so if everything goes super fast, it will be on the plane on Friday, but if it takes longer, which it might, it should be on the plane on Wednesday, which is her actual birthday, so that is perfect. And by Wednesday, I don't mean this week. I mean next week. I have no idea. Is it Monday? I think it's Monday. Anyways, I also decided to send her some Lululemon socks because I know she loves her Lululemon socks with like the the tabby thing on them. I don't know what they're called, so I sent her some of those. And the message <laughs> that I put on it was, Strudel's mom is a free elf. I don't know why I don't share her name. Yeah. <laughs> and then I reached out to her and one of the other girls I work with in the summer to be like, do you need some masks? Because I'm making a lot of masks. Um, and actually I started out by, hey, you know how funny your <laughs> tan line is going to be? And then I was like, but do you need masks? And so I will just keep making masks and I'll just bring out masks and I will have masks for my ladies. And, um, it just I need the ribbon and if all goes to plan I will have my ribbon by like no later than mid to late May so that should be fine and if it goes better than plan I'll have it before then and if things pan out this week I might even have some elastic to try some with elastic so that's exciting but that's where we're at I am sleepy I'm kind of sleepy I don't know I'm not like I don't know I don't know I don't know where I'm at with my brain right now I just want to like sing American Idiot the album really loud because I've been trying to pick my top five quarantine albums for work for the social media girl and I'm like oh, I should re-listen to American Idiot because I feel like that would be one of them and now I've just been blasting it and singing it so there's that and um I haven't got beyond the first one <laughs> I have about seven on my list and I think they're a good seven but I don't know anyways they need to be five is what I'm trying to say. Wow, my brain is not doing the thing right now. And by the thing, I mean functioning. So that's okay. That is fine. It is 20 to 11, so I should probably try to go to sleep now anyways because I have not been sleeping well lately and I need to sleep well. Sleep is a good thing. I woke up this morning, I don't think I mentioned it, but when I have to wake up early, I try not to pull down my um, blackout shades because then it's helpful and I get up because it's bright so I woke up this morning and I was like oh, I'm awake blah 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 and I like looked and I'm like it's really bright outside and then I was like oh my god what time is it and I thought I had super slept in not that it really mattered because like I was the only person going to work today so it's not like anybody was waiting on me and I'm just making up my own schedule anyway so it's fine but it was only 6 30 so hopefully that doesn't happen again tomorrow morning I did manage to get back to sleep for like almost an hour, but I'm just rambling now. I'm straight up rambling. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to stop vlogging. I'm going to listen to a little bit more Green Day. I'm going to download either podcasts for tomorrow at work or potentially audiobooks because 
once upon a time I saw the trailer for the Mortal Engines, the movie, and it looked kind of good, but I wasn't sure. And then I read the reviews and the movie was kind of bad. And so I was like, oh, well, maybe the book is good. And they were on sale for super cheap on Audible. So I bought the whole series, like four bucks. So there's that and then podcasts. Okay. I need to go now because I've been rambling for about five minutes and I'm not really, I'm not focused at all. It's fine. I'll see you tomorrow. Good night.